Let's keep with checking the stuff that could have valuables but doesn't. <gasps> There's actually money in there. I don't know if I should tell you what I just uncovered back here or not. I need to know. What are you talking about? Oh, welcome back. We bought another, finally bought another locker. Uh, we took a brief Corona break. He said it's about time again though. I'm feeling quite a bit better and ready. And I'm pretty excited about this one too. It's the type of locker we haven't bought in a while. They're a little scary, but why don't I show you inside before I talk about it anymore? Take two. <laughs> call, call maintenance. She said he was feeling better. Still <laughs> yeah. yeah. okay. got the Rona delirium. Uh. <laughs> Oh, back. look at that dust. Yeah, this is great for our health. This one is a very big locker, too. I don't know if it's as big as they said. It was a 10 by 25 or 10 by 30 in the listing. It was. It doesn't look that big. That's probably fortunate. Look at all the boxes back there. Look at all this, the dust on top of stuff in here. This stuff has been here. So you can tell it hasn't been moved. Let's look, peek under this. Look at that, look at the difference. I had to ask them. They said the person had been here a long time. He didn't know how long, though. Oh, should we start right out finding out if something we I was wondering about is in here? We didn't give him a very good tour yet, but this was something Should've brought I that leaf blower that we got from the other locker. Yeah, really. This, I can feel there's something in it, too. It's a Samsonite Silhouette uh, Ladies Onite Dover White. There's a little bit of filth that's gotten in there, but that's pretty cool. Wow. I don't think there's anything in it, but let's just go ahead and check since we have it out. Well, if it opens. I'm trying to open the wrong side. Oh, there's a key for it still. <laughs> Nothing in it. It's pretty nice though. It does have some. It is pretty dirty though. That's kind of surprising. Didn't you already look these up? Yeah, I, and it's kind of like I thought. The prices do vary a bit, and it probably for us will too, depending where we sell it. But you know, a couple of pieces. Speaking of which, this is the other one right here. But I guess I'm just gonna do them both together. Huh? This is the Pullman case from Samsonite. I think they're pretty darn old. I'm not sure what year what this was. I almost don't want to hazard a guess, but wouldn't be that hard to get definitely over a hundred maybe depending how patient we are maybe for the pair like a hundred and something I don't think I originally was counting on getting that much though for them oh lord I'm scared could be a critter living in here I don't think so Kaka! Kaka! <laughs> if there was it already turned to dust. if something answers me I'm running <laughs> it is way back there there were a lot of things I saw in here though that were signs of them of nice things in here. This this bag, this was an expensive store in our area. Sporto. Was a company. What? We might as well bring it out. I'm gonna set us up a table after this though. You done with your tour? Wait. Should we look at did you see back there all those boxes? There are a massive amount okay. of boxes. I'm gonna take this. Because this was something I'm, Oh, there's something in it too. I'm gonna take these out, which is really weird for us to go that far back because I bring a shop back or something up here. All right, I'll stop for a second. Get out of the table. One boot. <laughs> oh, oh, two boots. Oh, these are old. I don't know. That was a very small guy. Pair <laughs> <laughs> yep. of women's Tony, Tony Lama. How much are you usually get for Tony Lamas? Tony Lama, that's one of the better brands. Like those, being unusual vintage, it's a little tricky to say. Cool, let's take the boots and uh, leave the rest of the stuff. Yeah. Canada. And we're, oh, it's Toe cool. warmers. I don't know what kind of market there is for that type of boot yet. I don't know, those long puffy coats came back in. That is true. <laughs> These, this was the other thing that went with them right it here. It was. Ew, it's uh... Not Bakelite, what's the other one? Lucite? Lucite. Do we need to see if it works? Yeah, now it's oh, going wait. in the garbage. Oh my goodness, this is that a cute is... little vintage umbrella. Yeah. That's cute. Union Utility Chest. Union Chest Corporation. That is probably kind of cool. Has a measuring marks on it. Have to look that up. 
Yeah, I thought this was old when we were kids, for sure. That is cool, though. Super I like cute. Big hat. I thought this was a typewriter. But we'll see. Smith Corona. Maybe it's an electric typewriter. That's what it looks like. It doesn't look like to me, too. I just don't remember the magic secret for opening them. Ever could ever. So, oh, yeah. <laughs> told you. <ya. laughs> yeah. There it is. Smith Corona is a good brand. Yeah. I'm just not sure with the electric, you know, the mechanical ones, the old manuals. We just get a lot of money on those a lot. Actually, we just, just listed another one. What, uh, an Underwood Champion. I just listed it for like $300 yesterday. Hasn't sold yet, and that's kind of might be pushing it on the, on the price range, but these, I don't know. Just put beside that down. All right. This, oh, what is this? Actually, it's some cool old books. Hmm? Old dictionary? That one's kind of beat up, though. This is definitely old. 1955. <laughs> Garden City Publishing Company. Company. Well, this one's a like Garden City on it, too. Really? Oh, Garden City, New York. 1947 is the signature. Wow. Oh, looks like the author. Signed by the author in 1947. <laughs> That's an old, oh, that one's no good. A couple of prayer books and Bibles. Mini. Okay, that. Oh, there's something in there. Okay, we're gonna have to spend a lot of time double checking all these, all all this stuff. But we're gonna probably have to do some of that off camera because that could literally be a couple hours. Yeah. Look at this ancient book. Wow. But this is hard with the gloves on. I might have to take them off. I don't know if we mentioned that we were both getting over COVID. In case you're <laughs> wondering why he's sniffing. Oh. And I sound like I do. <laughs> Figured we picked the dustiest locker there was to get our yeah. immune system back on track. I've been feeling okay. He's like, I've been, like, been over getting. Well, I shouldn't say I'm not back to normal, but feeling better. You were normal to be <laughs> Yeah. Well, <laughs> everything's relative, they say. <laughs> 1953. Yeah, 1953. Daily Missile. Another Daily Missile. This has got some sort of cover on it. I don't know if we should bother. Something over the years we've sold a lot of books. Not as many as we used to, for sure. If you go back far enough, books were pretty, kind of pretty easy to sell. <laughs> For quite a few, we'd stumble across a lot Lives of valuable. Of Saint of the Saints. Is that 1955? These are all old. Those, those are gonna. Somebody would want those. That's something that the, the type of books that actually, when I look for books, I still look for those occasionally. Fuck. Huh? He took time the off. The OG us. of child rearing. Who would have known? <laughs> all those years of service on the Enterprise. <laughs> Smart women, foolish choices. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like you like that one. Well, another vintage daily missile. And let's see if that's a page torn out. Nope, that's something printed. But these have all kinds of stuff in all of them. Well, I have the scratch and stiff sticker in my scratch and stiff sticker collection. <laughs> Did you? Okay, that's the rest of those books. I think I held them up for the camera already. Oh. I'm supposed to be trying to hustle through these. Man, he's famous for breaking dishes. I crush the lampshades, he breaks the dishes. You keep saying I'm famous? <laughs> Are you kidding? I'm so far to caught. T-shirts made of, so flip of the mitten. I crush the lampshades. <laughs> <laughs> Courier and Ives print on that one. Those used to be something that people loved. Ooh, what is that? That's that milk glass. Oh yeah. That's cool looking. Yeah, they had a, so this for this locker was kind of hard to guess. These old ones with old stuff are hard to say. There's another one. Similar, slightly different color, same pattern. But there have been a lot of nice things you could see in here where they spent quite a bit of money on it. 
think it's some of the, they've been, what's that's two dollars or two or two hundred. That's some, no, there's no way. San Myro, that's pretty interesting. Uh, I'm a little sugar bowl. Oh yeah, it's got that logo. That one was gonna go in the flea market bin. Oh, here's a cup here. Look how cute that is. Oh, here's the, the Courier and Ives cup to go with that Courier, courier and Ives. Oh. Hello. Oh, another one Ooh. of those. I like it. Oh, that is a nice looking set. Let me check it out. <gasps> oh my goodness. Okay, I'll just take the boots and these. That's kind of stuff we were hoping for in those lockers. Yeah. Fitz and Floyd again. What is it? it is, oh, oh, he's got a chip there, darn it. Bummer. I don't know who he is, but that's, uh, oh, I know Fitz and Floyd. That wasn't who. I'm trying to remember. I was, I was thinking that's who made that. He's got an altitude. I like him. Uh -oh. <laughs> Did you find it? Goo goo. Oh. Germany. I don't know, it has an eye in the bottom. I don't have my glasses on and the sun's reflecting, just messing my eyeballs all up. Go way back and sit down. <laughs> what? <laughs> Goo -goo eyes. Oh, that goes with the green plate. Oh. oh, yeah, I guess I didn't show that. It's another one, another teacup that goes with those. It's got that luster wear look to it. Uh oh, this is another one to go through. Oh, look at that. They're supposed to sit next to each other. <laughs> oh, yeah, did I go and set it down before you even showed it? Hey, you don't know. I don't think I realized you were filming the inside it looks of this like box us. down here. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, which one am I? Am I the fat this one? one. <laughs> <laughs> They're both fat. <laughs> This might be okay. Last oh pepper? It is an original Da Vinci. <laughs> there we go. Is it actually wood? Uh, you know, oh, I it's think it's some sort plaster, of plaster, chocolate or something. Yeah, I'm not sure. They're clay. Yeah, I'm not. I <laughs> almost the back actually the way it is. Almost looks like paper mache on there or something. It's really heavy though. That is pretty cool, huh? Oh, it is heavy. That was kind of cool. This, this box I thought was going to be all the garbage I was just picking up out of the middle of the room there. So this is a Lady Sunbeam. It's one of the old hair dryers, I do believe. And it says dry your nails right here, too. Shut up. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. I don't see the cap, though. Oh, oh like they the have like a plastic vinyl type of hat. Do you slip like over your head? like a shower cap and you hook the hose to it. Well, too bad it doesn't have that. This seems like this would be very safe to go ahead and fire it up and stick it on your head. <laughs> <laughs> Look so at the nut. we laugh and start coughing. Yeah. Still may plug it in just to see. I mean, if it was cleaned up and get some of those rust off, somebody might want it for like a cute shelf thing. Yeah. Retro. Yeah, it is pretty cool. I just, I'm not sure dollar amount on this, even if like we had found it in good shape. I see something interesting else that we should check. Something else interesting, I should say. Because this looks really promising. Oh, maybe not. Yeah, it was a stifle or something. I thought it was. Stifle is usually... There it is right there. Yep, there it is. It is a stifle lamp. Yep, it's an old one too, and these chain pull ones are supposed to be one. worth money, more money. Look at this, that's ready too. This is the first model they made that wasn't that wasn't powered by oil. <laughs> Take the broom to that thing. Yeah, I'm gonna try to keep it all in here until I get a chance to clean up a little bit. You can't just set it in the middle of the parking lot, crazy. I'm gonna run it over on the way out. <laughs> soap holders. There's the tooth, uh, 
That's a nuclear That's travel mom. kit here. Yep. Toothbrush. That's probably still good. <laughs> Just kidding about that toothbrush. Still These are handy for camping. Put them in our camper. Okay. No. Oh, okay. Helped an international. Maybe or they I'll, give them back then. Maybe I'll try again with the toothbrush. The toothbrush is still good, I think. Like a little washy thing to wash yourself? I doubt the hotel was giving you something to polish your jewelry with, unless it was a really fancy hotel. I don't know. That looks valuable. <laughs> I'm just making sure there ain't no money I'm in this stuff. I've I just had to go through the boxes of stuff to find a couple of cool things. Another garment bag. Do we want these? Probably these are garbage. Uh, they're probably useful to somebody, but I don't know that we can hang on to those. Did we mention this locker was really, really dirty? Yeah, it's been sitting a long, long time, obviously. Oh, cool. McGregor? Who's on there? Willie Randolph. Yeah, we'll see. We'll look this one up. This vintage gloves. We've always sold those pretty well. Oh, it's old. It's old. Is that old Kmart, maybe? All Pro. Flex Hide. Don't you be making cute little hats? These are vintage. Oh. Those might be good. Be washed. Oh, those are old brushes right there. Oh, wow. See what that is? Oh, it pushes the hair off of there. That's cute. Yeah. You don't remember those? Yeah, but... Oh, okay. I just... I get confused. I'm a like... A weird little pool three... toy for kids, don't you think? Yeah. Cigarette <laughs> brand? Yeah, it is. That's what you were asking. Here, kids! <laughs> yeah. Don't forget to smoke cool. But yeah, that's uh, Radio Shack. Weird. Yeah. <laughs> Quite cool bag, but it's filthy. It's garbage. Where's my face mask? <laughs> oh. What in the world is happening? That'll keep the dust out of your mouth. Make sure you put the <laughs> <laughs> just put a clean side in, that's all. Well, that looks nice. Like hoping for like some old a vintage Burberry. Burberry. <laughs> That's How'd you know I was going to say Burberry? <laughs> because it has almost the right plaid and colors. Oh, here we go. Found one. 100% wool. Finale. Huh. All vintage, all wool, though. <laughs> oh, yes. oh, ho! Fancy! Outfit change. Quick change. <laughs> that is cute. It is cute. It is. It looks like it's something kind of nice. It is nice. It almost feels like it has silk in there. Oh yeah. yeah. Some more old school insulates. Oh look at that. Oh ski tags. Oh Mount Brighton. Skied there once, all the way down on my butt. <laughs> <laughs> They don't call that sledding? <laughs> Not when you get skis flying everywhere and poles. <laughs> <laughs> Woodward? Uh, I think uh, that it is an older and it's vintage, but I don't think it's one of the, like uh, something a desirable brand. Not to be confused with uh, Woolworth. Whoa. Super cashmere. Ooh. 100% acrylic. Oh, it's new improved cashmere. <laughs> what in the world? Oh, it does say made in Japan. Yeah. So it's prob probably, again, quite old, I'm sure. Are we keeping this? I don't know. We could go to the flea market or, yeah, donation or something. Here, my. I feel like that's garbage. Check out the shag bathroom outfit. Wow. Okay, that's going in the garbage. Well, there may be somebody filming a movie right now who needs to make their house look it's like dry that. dry rotted. Oh. Yeah, I was kind of kidding anyway. Sadly, we don't live where we can sell direct to Hollywood very often. We have people 
people have ordered we ship something to oh, Hollywood. Yeah. yeah, there have been a few times. Beverly we've... Hills. Oh yeah, definitely. And then Regularly. Once a, like Hollywood, California studio something. The I'm pretty label. sure it did. Yeah, I think that something like that has happened multiple times. We we're at least suspecting it was going to somebody to use for a, some kind of movie. Nine West. Oh, it's just nothing. So those are okay. They're not uh people do like those. They're actually usually all leather. Decent shoes. That it's if somebody wants that style or not. I'm kinda thinking maybe flea market or donation for that. Bass. Another one that makes nice quality. Oh, New Nine West once again. And some other little feet. Size six. I don't think that's all that small. Reality. I think they do still sell for Short us. Shortash. Oh, and those are actually from back in the day. Our day. Yeah. Those are the pants, the pants to have for sure. What on earth is that? Oh, it's a disintegrated shoe. Oh, yeah. You ever seen anything like that? Hmm? <laughs> uh, I already think that. There's no holes anywhere. That was the bottom pair too, right? Yeah. I don't know if I should tell you what I just uncovered back here or not. I need to know. What are you talking about? Every We all need to know. Oh my goodness. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. But it looks like a really nice grandfather clock. How are we going to get back there to check that thing out? I'm going to try to get, get in close up at least see if I can see the brand. Oh man. That's what's in it. Ah. A brand Windsor name. Windsor candy box. Oh, Indiana glass. Oh, okay. Oh yeah. That can be pretty good stuff to get. Side. Right. Yeah, it's all right for sure. Well, it's better than it's sellable. That's for sure. There's two of these boxes in there. Oh, Jeanette Glass. That's another collectible glass company. Oh, it's yeah. an old hurricane lamp. Oh. That could be a pretty good find there. And that's this is brand new. I just opened the box. That was the original? Yeah. Look. Hasn't been burned, that's for sure. There's another one down here. Okay. I'm kind of excited now. Gift bags. First year. Oh. Burn up. Yeah, you throw that scrap. in the recycle. Yeah, scrap. Oh, that looks nice. Copper. Swordfish and dolphins and stuff. Oh, nice. Oh, you know what? That has the same model number on it. So you think it's the same exact one? Yep, I think it's precisely the same thing, probably. Yep. Well, pretty cool. Ah. Old Christmas lights. Okay. Trusty. Deodorant Deodor. cakes. Huh. <laughs> I'm getting snack time anyway. <laughs> Old iron. I'm going to show you guys a few things because I think I'm going to be throwing some of the big stuff in the truck to get it out of here like this. this uh, Old ironing board. The wooden legs. I think I'm going to get this. These actually can be pretty nice. One of the types of microwaves we can get more than just a few dollars for sometimes if it works. The type of space saver like where they hang underneath your under under the cabinets I guess. And let's see, I was gonna try to get some big items. This dresser. Let's see oh, nothing in the drawers. Well here's the other one I think I might be getting out of here. That's actually a pretty cool one. Again it's all wood. It's actually really tall and narrow. It's probably over five and a half feet tall. 
All the drawers are empty though. And again, solid wood drawers. Yeah, not a, not nothing, not a thing in any of the drawers though. But yes, very heavy. Well, we're back. It's the next day. One of those '80s things that everybody was hanging up. Oh yeah, it's all brass, maybe. Yes. Yeah, They're pretty heavy too. Oh, it's copper. Wiped off. Now those copper or brass. There's a dust flying off that puppy. That's pretty cool though. Yeah. Let's see where we are. Dusty boxes. Oh, okay. Baskets. Oh, okay, I'll leave it sitting right there on the table. Uh, garbage. Garbage. Or donate, maybe. Okay. Yeah, we're oh, actually in there. Oh, those are cool. Third tub down, flea market. One, two, three. It starts from here. You got everything all set up out here to, again. Hundreds? Okay. Is it a bank? No. Oh. <laughs> Check that out. Oh, that's pretty cool. Classic. What? Wait, look this up. Yeah, I would throw that in the second tub. That's our, our look. Our... Looker upper tub? Yeah. Where's our donate tub? Uh, down past the end of the table. The last tub. Yep. So, here's, I'll have to give you the rundown because I was the one who set this up. It starts from best, best to worst, or I should, I don't know if that's the best way to put it, but stuff we know is going on eBay, places like that for sure. That stuff Look is up. questionable. Flea market, then donate, donate, and maybe um, scrap. scrap metal. Oh, garbage cans over there, too. Oop, should move this, huh? Dolly in the way. No baskets. Yeah, that would be a good oval. Oh, that is a cool pot back there, though. I think. The seashells. Oh, we sell those pretty well. Oh, it? Oh, that's cool. Handmade. I think it hangs on your pot. On the side of the pot. Yeah, that's pretty cute. This one. Oh, that is cute. Oh, it's a Hager. Oh, nice. Well, yeah. that one doesn't go to the flea market. Yeah, probably not. Although we sold a couple of Hagers at the flea market last year. <laughs> that was a nicer one, though, for sure. Oh, there's another one. Oh, that one, too. These are cute, though. Oh, those are great. We better put those. I don't know if we put them in the eBay bin. Because that... Because... Uh, if I could spit it out, I was trying to say that they're fragile. Okay, What's that it. metal thing right there? Is that, oh, it's just plastic? If it's not worth selling, that could go in the scrap bun, is all I'm saying. Made in, in Egypt. The Arab, Arab Egypt. Test it or not worry about it? Uh, I don't know. Throw it in the look up bin, I guess. Or the flea market, one of those two. Look how that oh, is. those are definitely a flashback. Let me know if you need a hand with something. Oh, I don't know doing that. Oh, okay, here. Switch. My turn. Oh, it's a whole new row, though. That is like either very early 80s or late 70s or something. All this, like, this, look, we bought this the same shopping trip. <laughs> they actually have a cool pot for them. Oh, yeah, I forgot that. that. I don't know. Pretty cool, at least, if nothing else. I tell you, it's crazy Michigan weather. It's warm and sunny again. Yeah, we'll be sweating <laughs> in a minute. Oh, this looks like it's probably going to be a cookie jar. Oh, there's stuff in there. Wait a second. Japan. Japan. Oh, that's cool. Japan also. I don't see a cork in it, though. That's probably the pepper shaker, maybe. Oh, that's cool. Swing rest. These are really nice. The glaze and everything on those. Salt. Those are really cute, aren't they? Aluminum lid for something. Oh, 
this might be the top to our. Ah. <laughs> that is. It's not what I was expecting. Me either. <laughs> it's, it seems really nice quality though. Uh, oh, this is a Fire King maybe. I can't read it. Glare. Oh, it is Fire King. <laughs> That's fire. Really yeah, the blue glass ones are pretty popular too. Oh, that's that actually, lit. no, that's, yeah, that was, oh, wait. Nope, maybe not. Vintage There's thermos. definitely some old stuff yeah. in here like we were wanting. <laughs> I don't know what I have there. Yeah, I got, I can't complain at all so far. I mean, I was I mean we knew it was going to be a project with the dust and everything. <laughs> and that there would be a, oh, that's kind of beautiful. Glass? That's, yeah, a real glass. I might be real careful with this box. This might be some cool stuff in here, hopefully. Oh, those glass Christmas tree. Oh, yeah, candy. the candy. I'm Classic thinking. grandma candies, the little yeah. green and red stripes. No idea what that is. Oh, an old, uh, just an old mason jar. Uh, Garbage. Yeah, easier freezer pack. We'll tell one about those. Oh, that one. I can feel it cracked already, too. There's a leak in here. Garbage too. Yeah, there's a lid for that candy jar. Oh, looks like another Fire King bowl. Oh, yeah, it is. The plain white ones, so actually, they do still sell. We can light them up, maybe. Yeah. Into the. I think it's. Oh, wait a second. We might be able to light them up because this might be the other one that goes with it. I don't really like shipping two giant bowls. Or this one's pretty big, but anymore. It'd be fine. <laughs> okay, that one's done. All right. Oh, look what else we found. Bow, bow, they haven't bow. seen this, I don't think, because we just saw this. Firewood. <laughs> <laughs> you know, oh, this, this thing. <laughs> I wasn't sure. I don't think these have come back yet. I don't know what we can get. It's been a little while since we've sold one. We used to sell a lot of sewing and machines. Wheels. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Can't get a good picture of it. Look how pretty that is. Oh, losing pieces. Uh, I see it back there. Might be there. Here it is. Oh, that. You should probably stand up and get a look in here. Wait for the big reveal. Ooh. Ah. Pretty nice. I'm looking for the model and stuff. This one's pretty darn old. There's look at something this. right here. Ah, there it is. I mean, it has a serial number there. That out. Wow. No electricity needed. Oh. Accessories. <laughs> shoulder pads. The all important shoulder pads of the eighties. More accessories. Yeah, this thing is very old. It's beautiful too. Oh. I five. This is my old mixtape. <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember these cases? Okay. Oh, okay. What in the world? Huh. Oh wow. Actually that is way nicer than I expected too. Is it really heavy? Yeah. I was looking at this this part and I didn't think it was going to be all that great. Yeah. Well, that's actually kind of beautiful. Yeah, huh. that'd be gorgeous in somebody's house. Somebody may actually buy that. I, I first glance I thought it was going to be headed for the scrap pile. Oh, what do you find it down there? I don't know, but it's got that. Yeah, plastic just open handle? it right here for me. Oh, okay. I thought it was going to be records. Jingle Bell Rock. 
Sonny James. Ivory Joe Hunter. J.V. Lewis. Oh, it's Presley. What does it say? I couldn't quite read that one. Wait. I'll never let you go. go. I'm gonna sit. sit right down and cry. Over you. So anyways, a whole box full. It's like that opalescent glass, but like a smoky color. That is pretty cool. It's actually a very beautiful dish. This is just the lighting is just making everything look nice to me. It's a picky bank, and guess what? He's actually mm. really cute, too. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah, I don't know how you would ever get the money out. The hammer. That's my up. Has change also and a key. Oh, that other bank will find it. Oh, that oh one. that's uh, Gobel. the Hummels. Yeah, bank. You can make the Hummel stuff. Oh, I can't, I don't want to smash this one. Yeah, yeah that'll take a little time open. to fish them out. Oh, look at that tricky key. Line up the holes. There it goes. Oh, I have a tub for those. It is cool. It's like the jars where you guess the amount. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a few bucks there though, for sure. They were pretty cool. Wonder what the ages are on them. That one's oh, 1991. So at least as late as that, people have somebody's been putting something in these. 1990. <laughs> yeah, you can probably get them out of there. Okay. Some other way. It's so full of tank. Oh, was it? Okay. Got our own little piggy bank here. So a few more of those piggy banks so we'll be straight on oh. what we paid for the locker. <laughs> speaking, of, speaking of, another piggy bank. Wow. Keep asking for stuff. Oh, got the same key. So it's another uh, Goble. Yeah. Oh, you're an expert at these now. said you're an expert at these now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this you sure you don't want that tub to dump on the plane, Jim? Look. Oh. Oh. Run away money. That's pretty cool. And the banks actually are, are actually, actually might have some value. Being that they're banks with the key. Well, actually, we don't, you have only one key total so far. Right there. Yeah, Goebel, West Got Germany. You know they're... Pretty old. They still say West Germany. Find more. Wow. Should we should we separate the the uh, Kennedy fifty cent pieces? Yeah, Kennedy. count it when we get home. Wow, we'll look at all sharp the edges and stuff. These have been in that bank a while. Count it when we get home. We okay. Can put it in the video how much we wound up getting out of the banks. Getting out of the banks. For those. <laughs> uh, gotta shake them first now. Yeah, we're gonna do that the whole way, huh? Ah. Uh, oh, that's, that's cool. Cute too. Yeah, handmade. Ooh. He matches the. That's the grown-up of the little piggies. I wonder what the symbol is. Wow, look how much patinas on that. Wow. Is this plastic or what? I don't know. I'm not sure why. Oh wait, it's on the back. Sirenetti. I'm not familiar. It looks so familiar for some reason. I got no idea what I'm looking at though. Oh look. That's pretty cool. This looks very familiar. We've had other figures that are almost identical to this guy here. 
Not with an hourglass, though. That's cute. Oh, it's oh. another Goble. Wow. It doesn't say a uh, Hummel anywhere on it, does it? Just out of curiosity. I don't know if that helps yeah. on Helps or hurts, or I don't know. I shouldn't say helps or hurts. Oh, again, this is why we bought this locker for these types of collectible things. That is very true. So far, so good. Oh, you know what? Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> you figured it out for sure. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding, though. No, that was pretty good, though. I didn't even remember you got that other thing. Oh, this is an old locker. Free electricity. <laughs> <laughs> you can cut that weird COVID laugh out. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's cute though. Oh, it's almost Easter. This is um, super cute. That is really nice too. I mean, I, I guess what I'm saying, when you find pottery, oh, what does it say? Something Mexico. Can't quite make that out. If you on the camera, they'll be able to tell. Sometimes you can tell better once we get that. Yeah, yeah. I have to look that one up. That's really nice with the like the added artwork and everything. That's I like that. This is a good box. Yeah. I'm glad you pointed it out that these are some like the, some of the types of things we were, we were hoping to find in here. Oh, it's the only yeah. reason we bought this dusty thing. Yeah. Well, it reminded me to appreciate the, <laughs> to appreciate this box and we have the because it is fun opening these things too. Oh, that's nice too. Yep, we've done good selling those. I mean, normally not for a ton of money, but talk about something easy to list and ship though. Oh, is that like, not quite mercury glass. Yeah, I'm not sure. Oh, it's a match oh. to the other mouse. Oh, we got a little chip here. Now let's do it together. Oh, oh. This part's broke too. Oh, bummer. Oh, wow. In the world? Is it just a letter opener? Just It sure is awful cool. heavy for one. Yeah, I'm not positive. The mouse is wood. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Definitely brass though. That's pretty cool. Paperweight? Yep. Oh, wait, or does it stand? It has a flat side for standing pretty this type of stuff people will people actually buy oh, oh a toothpick holder it's super old though oh look another global say capitamante Oh, oh. Huh. Is it is it not broken at all either? No. Oh, that actually. I don't know I'm if it's to... another toothpick holder. Yeah, it just might be. I don't. It doesn't look like it'd be much of a candle holder. They may have a little bit of value. Uh, Their other stuff is worth pretty good money. Yeah. Another, another gobel. It's heavy. Oh. Crystal Hershey's kiss. <laughs> yeah, look how be... pretty it is. Yeah, it sure is. Yeah. How cool that looks. Wow. Shining like a diamond. Oh, here's this that. Uncovered. It is a colonial, a colonial of Zealand. I'll bet you this is going to be at least two or th probably at least two or three hundred dollars. I'll bet. It's kind of ornate. It's very tall too. Thing. Should I just go ahead and get it out? Because I might try yeah. to get this home today. It sounds beautiful too. <laughs> it does. It's a nice one. Where she be in her glory? Yeah, that's very nice. Made in the USA. Gonna check out what this cool thing is. I don't, at least it looks cool. Tucked under there. I take it out. Nothing in there. I don't know why I thought I saw some stuff in there. It must have just been this, some screws, shelf. Let's get the shelf stood in here. I would say that it's a guess. little karaoke wall cabinet. 
It's actually kind of cool. I really didn't think much of it. I, just, I thought I saw stuff in there, is why I was excited. But, oh, I can't get that back. There we go. Uh, maybe I'm starting to get some nostalgia for some of this era or something. So we got these they're actually sturdy chairs, but I don't think those are going to be enough. I don't know, that's a pretty cool color, though, at least. Yeah, yeah, I, don't I don't know if somebody wore them for basement chairs. Yeah, they're actually probably some pretty good quality chairs. So Why don't you to... move these to where the clock was? Oh, or just outside, and these can go with us. Why don't I just drag these a couple at a time when we'll out there and see what's in these? Look at that. Was this uncovered right there when I picked it up? It is pretty dirty. I'm standing downwind of the dust. Feeling there. pretty light though. This might be. I got kind of excited to see all these jewelry looking boxes, but I gotta check them though. Nothing. Nothing. This was 14 karat gold. What do you think the odds are it's stored in there somewhere? Little gallery by Hallmark. Sometimes these are handy for us at least, but they're clean. Okay. For real? <laughs> disappointment after disappointment. Yeah. You get a locker full of jury boxes. And yeah. Every last. 50 of them are empty boxes. Empty. Maybe there's a jury box in that back corner that we ain't got to yet. Yeah, maybe. Okay. Oh, you checked them all? I checked every last one of them. Winkleman's? Winkleman's. Wow. Those are old. Let's keep with checking the stuff that could have valuables but doesn't. Oh, <gasps> there's actually money in there. <laughs> what on earth? Wow. I tell you dollars. to check the books for money and cards. Nobody ever talks check. about the hats. <laughs> Look, it's still got the seven dollar price tag in it. We can get our money back in cash out of this one. <laughs> right. Oh, what is that? Vintage treasure. Last supper again. And the back of it. Okay, because this would be clearly the front, right? I don't know. The back of it appears to have a secret hatch to me, and I don't think I can get my finger in there. Some what kind of relics. religious thing, and we don't know what it is. Because look, these go here. Candles. The holy water goes in the middle, maybe? I don't know if you really do that, but that's what this was probably it was holy water. And this is, I think this is just silver plate right here. This thing. I'm going to right back in there. Oh, altar. Made by the Homan, H O M A N, Manufacturing Company, Cincinnati, Ohio, January 11th, 1910. What? Wow. Altar Sick Call outfit. This is an altar sick call outfit. Maybe for, for prayers for people when they're not well. Is it cure oh, COVID? Is kind of, <laughs> this is really that is kind of actually amazing. I'm kind of excited about that. Oh, box is garbage. Oh my goodness. This is fascinating. This is uh, some sort of real blast from the past year. That looks like it was before they took it down when they moved or something. Like it was actively, like someone in 1978 took this off the wall with everything in it. You want to go through the other one? Actually, those are kind of cute. Far out. Yeah. Wow. Is that an old radio? Can't see. I think it says Boulevard on the front. It does. I was just. I don't think I found the book. How oh, weird. Batteries do work. That's what I was gonna see. Wow. We need to find out what brand are in there. For real. What on earth? That's hilarious. Oh, super, super transistor. Just about to say, I wonder if it's one of the ones we have to take the case apart to get at the batteries. Yeah, right there. It's got the screwdriver slot and everything. Good old day. I can't believe those batteries are still kicking out some sort of energy out of them. That's cute. I don't know. 
Draper. Important message, right? Oh, I've, I remember those. We little paintbrush. Little mouth. That was a pretty interesting box. What do you think about it so far? It's been pretty good? Yeah, there's a lot of garbage like we thought, and there's a lot of vintage like we thought. Yeah, exactly. I don't know if this was a great one to tackle on our recovery mission, but here we are. Yeah, it was. <laughs> this is definitely a tough one for that. As you can tell, we're not as lively as we usually are. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's still a ton of boxes back there, though. And to be honest, I was kind of thinking that more of the good stuff would end up further back just because all oh, the old kids toys like the old Star Wars toys or things like that from what have been packed up earlier and figurines and that and if you haven't subscribed already please do uh, we get a lot of cool stuff in these lockers all year long and thanks for watching and we'll see you soon